began to communicate with one another. Now we can hunt as a team and survive together. It takes 15,000 years to come up with the next bright idea, recording our knowledge on cave walls. There was only one small problem. When we moved, the recorded knowledge stayed behind. Now let's move ahead to ancient Egypt, because something is about to happen here that will change the future forever. unknown Egyptian pounding reeds flat is inventing papyrus, a sort of paper. Papyrus in turn creates better record keeping of plans, designs and unfortunately taxes. But it also brings with it the dawn of great civilizations. At this point, each civilization has its own form of writing, which none of the others can understand. But the Phoenicians, who trade with all of them, have a solution. They create a simple common alphabet adaptable to most languages. Remember how easy it was to learn your ABCs? Thank the Phoenicians. They invented them. The ancient Greeks were great inventors of the future. First, they establish public schools, and then begin teaching an intriguing new subject called mathematics. And with math comes mechanical technology and the birth of the high-tech life we enjoy today. With lessons learned from the Greeks, the Romans create a powerful empire. To move their armies around, they build a system of roads all over the known world. Rome built the first World Wide Web, and it's leading us into the future. But then we hit a roadblock. Rome falls, and the great library of Alexandria in Egypt is burned. Much of our learning is destroyed, lost forever. Or so we think. It turns out there are copies of some of these books in the libraries of the Middle East, being watched over by Arab and Jewish scholars. Call it the first backup system. The books are saved, and with them our dreams of the future. Here in Europe, monks toil endlessly recording books by hand. But that is about to change. Gutenberg invents the movable type printing press. Now knowledge can travel as fast as these new books, and travel they do. Books make it easier to invent the future in every field, and the result is an incredible explosion of innovation we call the Renaissance. technology races headlong into the future and soon people all over the world are sharing life's most important moments faster than ever before.
By now, we're all communicating from anywhere on Earth, and in 1969, from somewhere else. It's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. To send a man to the moon, we had to invent a new language, spoken not by man, but by computers. At first, very large, very expensive computers, but we see the potential. What if everyone could have one of these amazing machines in their own house? There's just one problem. They're as big as a house. The solution comes in, of all places, a garage in California. Young people with a passion for shaping the future put the power of the computer in everyone's hands. Together we form a super network that glows with billions of interactions. And once again, we stand on the brink of a new renaissance. After 30,000 years of time travel, here we are. A truly global community, poised to shape the future of this, our spaceship Earth. Please remain seated. Attention. You are now rotating backward for your return to Earth. Please remain seated, time travelers. Attention travelers, please remain seated. Your time machine is rotating backward for your return to Earth. In preparation for your return to Earth, your time machine... For the first time in history, all of us can have a say about the kind of world we want to live in. The choices we have made for the past 30,000 years have been inventing the future one day at a time. And now, it's your turn. Let's have some fun creating the future, shall we? On your computer screen, answer a few questions for us. Then we'll show you a new world, custom made just for you. Ready? in some amazing new technology that we happen to know about. future is just about ready. Let's take a look, shall we? Welcome to the future. Or should I say, your future. Here in your future, it'll be more fun than ever to enjoy your extreme sports adventures. But even 
in a perfect world, accidents do happen. Don't worry. With your Take Charge attitude, you're prepared. A portable medical scanner analyzes the situation. Fortunately, your entire medical history is with you at all times on a smart card. The best surgeons in the world are always on call, thanks to real-time video links and remote-controlled instruments. And while you relax at home with hot chocolate, technology speeds recovery time. In no time at all, you're back on your feet. Uh-oh. Fortunately, in the future, help is never far away. The end.